It is an honor and a privilege to have you as a fan of celebrity news and lifestyle, where you have kinds of your genuine juicy news concerning your favorite celebrities. Take your precious time to sit down and let's share thoughts together with love and peace. We'll be seeing a new skills from our great tennis player Coco Gauff the best in the world. Corey Coco Gauff has earned a spot at Wimbledon this year. In other words, she shouldn't be there. The 20-year-old from Atlanta was shopping online when she discovered that despite her low ranking, she could compete in the world's most prestigious tennis tournament. The new tennis star reached the fourth round before being eliminated by Romanian Simona Halep, who won the tournament after defeating Serena Williams in the final. Now, Gorf has received another wild card into this year's US Open. Gorf, currently ranked 140th in her second Grand Slam, is expected to participate in the tournament draw on August the 22nd, with the event officially starting four days later. This will be her third wild card this year, as age restrictions imposed by the Women's League limit the number of tournaments a 15-year-old can participate in, and the number of wild card invites she is given. However, according to the WTA, the US Open is not governed by the WTA or ATP Tour, so you can choose to ignore the qualifying rule and give Gorf a wild card. Thanks to his excellent summer and obvious athleticism, Goff had a rapidly growing fan base. The teenager, ranked 301st in the world before Wimbledon began, cemented her place in history with a maiden serve at the All England Tennis Club. She is officially the youngest player to qualify for the main draw of Wimbledon since the start of the Open era in 1968. In the first round of a Grand Slam, Goff eliminated her sporting heroine Venus Williams. She also won another prize, becoming the youngest player to win a match at Wimbledon since 1991. After fighting through the fourth round to the delight of her fans, Gorf was eventually knocked out in straight sets by Romanian Simona Halep on July the 8th, but she focused on the positives. It was definitely the best week of my life, she said in a press conference with the BBC after the match. If someone had told me that three weeks ago, I probably wouldn't have believed them, she added. I think just working will definitely increase my confidence because I know how hard I work, and I know I can shoot and what I can do. But for Gorf, she's been focused on the long game since she was a kid. She started playing tennis at the age of seven, and eventually left Atlanta for Florida to focus on the sport. Not only did her father, Corey, a former Georgia State University basketball player, coach her, but her mother, Candy, was also a gymnast before she turned to track and field. When I was a kid, everyone had a big dream Gorf recently told Vogue after her time at Wimbledon. But there are many people who are afraid to follow their own people. I'm just an example to try, because with tennis, the worst that can happen is to lose. Goff is one of three siblings and has two older brothers, Cody and Cameron. The young player trained at the Marataglu Academy. Serena Williams' former coach, Patrick Marataglu, went to France at the age of 10. And on August the 26th, we'll wait to see what piece of history Goff contributes this time around. Thanks for reaching out to Celebrity News and Lifestyle and for watching our videos till the end. If there's something about this video that you like to share, please do share with us. And guys don't forget to subscribe, like this video, share and leave your comment on the comment section below your comments, matters see you next time.